Yo, 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 what is up, YouTube? Playing some Hunbats today, and I was actually not planning on recording, because it's the weekend. I was not planning on recording at all. I just had a little bit of time, and I was like, I don't know, bro, I kind of want to play Hunbats, but I don't want to deal with teammates. So, like, I was just going to play a duel casually, you know, for fun. And we actually got Trelly. I'm sure he's trying to get a duel recording himself, and I figured, you know, why not? Why not record it, dude? Why not record the game? Because if it's a good one, I'll want to upload it, you know? <laughs> Regardless of win or loss. And also, this is kind of like a funny match, too, because it's like two low-tier... Well, a lot of people consider them low-tier assassins in duel. I actually think Hunbats is really good. I'm not sure about Pele. And I missed one of these creeps, man. That's kind of sad, actually. I wonder if he comes and invades me. That'd be sad. No, he didn't. I probably should have picked up the blue buff, to be honest. I I'm out of it, man. I am out of it. <laughs> I saw it was Trelly. Oh. I saw it was Trelly and I got so excited. I was like, oh snap. And he's not even playing. A Neither one of us are playing a super tryhard god. Oh, I'm definitely beating his buns, surely. Neither one of us have a blue buff. Although I got a chalice. Oh, wait, no, he got a chalice too, but he started Soul Eater. So he has more mana potions. He's gonna out clear me here, which is fine. I'm not gonna jump because he has his ultimate, so. Even though I don't think he would kill me either way, but. That's fine with me. <laughs> he does no damage. <laughs> I wonder if I just stay and ult this wave, man. Although, I, I will say it's pretty troll, to be honest. <laughs> we debated him. We debated him. I'm just kidding. Yeah, he actually gets a lot of pressure off of that, but the stuff doesn't spawn for a little bit. The blue buff. I mean, not the blue buff. The red buff. I'm colorblind. The red buff does not spawn for a bit. We might lose a little bit of XP here. Yeah, we're going to lose like one or two creeps, depending on how long my uh, aggro stayed on him there, which is okay. This star is better, I think. I haven't actually looked at the stats. 15 versus 20, so I have more power. He just has life steal, and I have mana sustain. But I actually don't have better mana sustain, though, is the thing, because, um... Because he had more mana potions than I did, so... That part is a bit unfortunate. I just realized I have a knock of me in two now, huh? can't really fight him, unfortunately. I just have to back. I don't, I don't even have my finished item, and he does, so. I need to go straight to my wave instead of speed, but I want to go to the speed. I'm losing a lot of farm in the early game, to be honest. Which is okay. It's okay. I wish I picked up the blue at the very beginning. I feel like this stuff would not have happened if I picked up the blue. Very unfortunate. Very unfortunate. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I don't even know when this video is going to come out, when I decide to post it, I guess. I don't know. But, um, because I didn't plan on recording. I was just going to play one or two duels for fun, but the only reason I'm recording is because it's Trelly. Not even just because it's someone I know, it's because it's Trelly, dude. Like, we hate this guy. We hate this guy. <laughs> I'm just playing. Obviously, we don't hate him, but we hate him. You know what I mean? Like, like we don't hate him, but, like, we kind of hate him. Like, does that make sense? I hope that makes sense for you guys. I'm trying to be as clear as possible. Like, I hate him, but I don't, like, hate him. Run up to this speed buff here. Something I should have been able to do forever ago. He's kind of destroying me in the farm game, but that's okay. I think my character is better. I think I scale better. I think we're just built differently here. It's okay. Don't worry. I think we have a better gamer chair than him in pretty much every, you know, pretty much every aspect here. We're chilling. He is going to be running oom in these fights, though, if he, if he decides to spam a bit. I need to be a little careful, because when my jump's down, he can definitely ult me. And even if I ult my feet to peel, he has beads, so. Definitely have to be a little bit, a little bit, uh, cautious about where and when I jump. But yeah, Hunbats actually got buffed. I don't remember when it was, if it was like recent or not, but he got buffed to where his 2 is now knockup immune. So I can 2 
his uh, his two. Definitely not not an amazing matchup for him, and so far in my head, anyways. So far, what I'm thinking in my head doesn't sound too good. My ult him here for beads. He didn't use it. We're just gonna walk away. We don't get punished at all for using our ult like that, so it's okay. Although we we do kind of want it for the red buff, but I'm gonna do this build because I think it's fun. I'll, I'll be completely honest. I don't think Soul Eater like double stacking on a uh, Hunbats is to play in duel. Like I'm pretty sure you're supposed to just go full damage. Like uh, not that Soul Eater doesn't do damage, but you're supposed to go full damage and just play for uh, play around your ults and and you know burst fights. But like this is more fun, so. And I think this matchup is in my favor. So there's a little bit of uh, wiggle room to, you know, have some fun with it. Have a good time, if you will. Of the jungle, man. Hopefully we can at least get a couple of these small creeps, at the very least here. We don't really want to take too much poke. Because of, uh, we're definitely not going to heal as much as him. We're okay here. We could just shell this. Yeah, he's diving a bit. He can, though. He has full defense and soul leader. Like, he has, like, the perfect build for fighting me right now. So, he honestly can get away with that pretty easily. Like, I, I, I kind of thought we might be able to kill him there. I got I got a little excited, admittedly, but in the back of my head, I kind of knew we couldn't. Bum, bum, bum. Alright, we're actually getting to the point where we can kind of kind of slay out a little bit. We're definitely going to overcap CDR on this build, by the way. Full disclosure, because I am going to go Hydra's, but that's okay. I'm going to go Hydra's Breastplate. So, um, that's going to be 50% CDR, which is totally fine with me. No problem whatsoever. Actually, I don't even know why I'm leveling my 3, actually. I think the... Well, no, the 3 is okay. I need to start putting points in my ults to get the cooldown. You keep me safe. We're gonna wait and see what he gets for second relic here. Because if he doesn't get something, um, like if he doesn't get like a sprint or something, I can go horrific. That would be really good. That is not how I meant to use that ability, to be clear. We can kind of fight here, but not super well. I think we're chilling here. Oh, I missed. No, I missed my three, dude. I kind of just like autopiloted and auto aimed it because like he was just running at me and I figured he would continue to run at me. Dang, that's my, that's bad. What is happening? <laughs> no way, dude. That actually worked out in the end. No way. <laughs> All a part of my plan the whole time. Like, my plan was to survive there. I was not worried about dying, but I also didn't think I would actually get the kill due to the fact that I missed my three twice back to back. <laughs> I missed my three. I definitely could have killed him two times there. But I suck. But we don't suck too much, you know? Like, we suck, but not too much. Because we did end up winning the fight, still. I kind of want to stay here. I don't want him to push this. He might go for my blue, but that's okay. Honestly, I, I'd rather, like, save my tower. And, uh all that good stuff then uh defend my blue i don't even want the buff so we're chilling uh, hydras all right he's not getting a second relic dude he's too smart 
Although, actually, I don't even think it's that smart. Like, maybe you should just go sprint. Like, because, honestly, he's just in a bad spot. Like, it's not even his fault. I think it's just matchup-based, where, like, I benefit from him not... From us both having one relic, I think I benefit more than he does. So, therefore, it's like, I want to say he's being dumb for not building a second relic. But it's like, if he builds a second relic, he gets... Like, he's just damned if you do, damned if you don't, you know? Like, he doesn't really... <laughs> He doesn't really have a good option here. You stay. I go. Attack! <laughs> I don't think we start this, to be honest. I think he's gonna come. Was he not gonna come? Am I am I am I tripping? Paranoia. I guess he was doing all of his camps, huh? I'll try it again when I get to Hydra's completed. Still no second relic by the Trailster, man. Still no second relic. I actually knew that camp was down from when we talked about it earlier, and I still did that. I'm a goofy goober. Is he going to come back? Yeah, he is. I want to back for Hydra's after this. He's coming to stop my back. And he got it. Man, we're over the wall. It's that easy. It's just that easy. He might get red buff pressure here due to that push, but... And we're over this wall. <laughs> Having a jump is so OP in this game mode, man. He's gonna get our blue buff again. And he's going for the red. That's fine. Honestly, that is perfectly fine with me. I kind of just want to back up here. Uh, what do we want, honestly? We need like a brawlers or something. We definitely need like a brawlers or something for his soul eater. Kind of greedy that we haven't gotten it already. He's about to get his. I can only assume. We can definitely, like, uh, make a play where we buy our second relic. And he doesn't expect it. Like, he thinks that I'm going to hold it. And we, we force the fight. I think that's what we'll do, honestly. We'll buy a ward as well. I love going Monko mode, man. I love this character. so fun. I don't really play him in, like, a lot of modes, to be honest, but... I mean, I guess I shouldn't even say in a lot of modes. I just don't play him, to be honest. But he's a lot of fun. He doesn't... That was, like, a million damage, I feel like. Okay. He ults me, and we have jump. We have shell here, so we have shell. So our main goal here, <clears throat> our main goal here is just to kind of like run around and be annoying. Because I feel like Hunbats, I mean, that's not even like in this matchup particularly. Hunbats just has so much mobility. I feel like you can kind of get away with a lot of stuff. <laughs> I should just be going to Bull Demon, but I'm just going to stand here and dance. Nah, okay, we don't need Bull Demon. We can, uh... We can do this. Oh, my thing doesn't go through walls. He might have blink here. I have sprints. Okay. Alright, so we definitely back here and we hope he doesn't stop us. Because that would be really annoying and really bad for us. All right, the tower's on him once again. I tried to bait him. It did not work. <laughs> I tried to make him think that I was jumping on him. I 
This really sucks for Pele like, in this match. Like, there's multiple things that suck for Pele in this matchup. Don't get me wrong. It's not just one thing. But, like, just the fact that she can't really get over walls, and I can. Like, this matchup isn't, isn't like, completely one-sided. It's like, Pele does a lot of damage. As you guys can see, I have to run away from her and stuff. But, uh, yeah, it's definitely not in her favor. I, I have concluded. <laughs> I have concluded. Knock-up immunity on my part. Uh, a better ultimate, I would argue. Um, more mobility. This matchup's just not so good for her. I want to go Heartseeker. Because I love Heartseeker, but... Is it better than Titan's Bane here, last slot? I don't know. It's definitely more expensive than Titan's Bane, I'll say that. It's definitely more expensive. Alright, whatever, we'll do this. <clears throat> Although I think Titan's Bane is probably the more competitive option here. Uh, I'm just a I'm just a lover of the uh the good old the good old Heartseeker. What is happening right now? Beware of the jungle man. Beware of the jungle man. here he sprinted it that's okay we want the horrific for the debuff as well and he's dead <clears throat> horrific like the good thing about it is it still does stuff even if they immune it with their movement speed is the thing um because it still debuffs the damage and attack speed so them simply sprinting it isn't just like a counter i even know i could be zero too early that is rough I mean, we can do one more fight. I don't know if he wants one more fight or not, honestly. I'll just... I'll just give it to him. One mo. I don't know, like, because it's really hard to tell in these situations. Like, he's either want, he either wants me to end because he's tired of this and thinks that this matchup is bad for him, which it is. Or he doesn't want me to end. He wants me to give him one more fight, you know, to make it more fun. Like, it's really hard to gauge. I just have to guess. I mean, I could ask him, but... I suppose I could ask him. Is that even better than just buying this and a and a red pot? To be honest, not gonna backdoor. I want him to feel free to like come out and fight. Is that's the reason why I'm telling him. I want him to come out and fight. If he has to be scared that I'm gonna walk past him the whole time. He, he play, he'll play a little bit different. Attack monkey. You have slain an enemy. This can't be right. <laughs> yeah, this matchup is not good for him at all. That is so unfortunate, bro. What the? I mean, obviously he didn't have beads there, but. Hero has canceled mine every time. Oh, dude, that sucks, dude. That's actually terrible. I don't. I don't think he should be too salty about this matchup, though, uh, or about this loss. To be honest, I mean, you can be salty about a loss no matter what you want. I mean, no matter what, obviously. But he shouldn't feel bad about this loss, is what I mean. Because this matchup is so Hunbat's favorite. It's not even close. <laughs> like this. Uh, this uh, matchup is definitely fully in Hunbat's favor. I'm gonna tell him that. Yeah, no chance Pele wins this. That looked so annoying. <laughs> yeah, it's... I think it was a few months back. Yeah, no, that, that matchup is terrible for him. 100%. <sighs> GG.
All right, anyways, if you guys did enjoy, I appreciate you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, you know, hit me with the like button. Hit me with the subscribe button. I don't know what all these YouTubers say. I appreciate you guys for watching. Uh, you know, it's fun because we're low-tier assassins. And it's, you know, I know him. We're both content creators. We're both low-tier assassins. Although, even though we're both low-tier, mine is just, this matchup is terrible for Pele. There's just no way. <laughs> appreciate you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.